Thanks for joining us. Today, we're going to react to a little clip from Newsmax, uh, some reporting on the shooting that happened in Allen, Texas. If you don't know, uh, an assailant by the name of Mauricio Garcia. I think that's how you say his name. Mm -hmm. Not that I care about pronouncing it right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he shot and killed uh, eight people and wounded uh, several people in Texas not too long ago. So we're going to react to this clip of and Newsmax. Over. Of Newsmax and the overall like narrative that this is not attached to white supremacy. Yo. Which yeah. is the pretty, this video is pretty much the catalyst into that conversation. Yo. So, yeah. Yeah. You know, um, how Newsmax is also trash. <laughs> it's a trash network. It's bottom tier, in my opinion. You just, you just starting off with the, with the bullets. I'm just saying, bro, Newsmax is not somewhere where I, I would want to get news from, bro. Yeah. Because for me, and I ain't trying to be disrespectful to their networks. I'm pretty sure there's some people that it tries hard and stuff like that. Yeah. But when I watch it, I, I instantly think of SNL. Like, I think this whole thing is, I think these are actors. Just, like, this, yeah. these are people just playing a part. Like, for as far as the haircut, the mannerisms, the the, the reporting, it just seems, like, so ridiculous. Yeah, it's like, they too far into it's the It's just road. too far, yeah. bro. They yeah, leaned yeah, yeah, too, yeah. lean too far into it. It's just it, yeah. too far. That I was just like, bro, this don't, I don't feel right yeah. watching yeah, this, man. like, this can't be real. This is like I'm watching, this is like I'm reading something on The Onion or something. Yeah. Like, this, is this supposed to be satirical? Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, The Inquirer or something. Like, it's, yeah. it's, 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 it seems ridiculous. I, I feel you on that. And they probably done, they, these probably are real people, this is how they probably had their everyday life, but as far as how I feel about it, Ridiculous. <laughs> Trash. But um, yeah, we're going to do that. I'm TK. Like, comment, and subscribe. I'm TK, a.k.a. The Destroyer of Conviction. I'm Darius, a.k.a. The Mirror of Truth. And this is my guy. Oh, yeah, check out our merch. You know yeah, saying? check out our merch that's coming out at some point. We're going to play the video. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so let's, let's hop into it. ...whatsoever. Until they told us this guy did it, Mauricio Garcia... And oh yes, a white supremacist with neo-Nazi ties. Now, look, this is not a white supremacist. And oh, by the way, we abhor white supremacy. But you know what the left does, right? They think anything MAGA must be white supremacist. That is appalling. This is just pathetic, all right? Now, there's a tattoo, many tattoos. And someone at one point tried to say, that's the, the, the city of Dallas tattoo. No, it looks like it's the Puro Tango Blast prison gang tattoo, no, all right? This is, um, this is not a white supremacist. Yes, if you stand on your head and cross your eyes and take a drag on a cigarette, one of those etchings might look like a swastika. All right, this is, well, this is what they do now. Um, this is what it's all about. Trying to tarnish or somehow diminish the other side by any means possible. This again, totally pathetic. Mm -hmm. Now, in the hours after, I wish you. I wish I knew we was pausing it. I definitely paused early because I don't even. That's no, the, that's I, the end of the video. Oh, that's the end of the that's video. The end of the okay, video. then we're good. Then I don't even think that's the guy. No, that's not the right guy. Okay, that's the then. wrong guy. First that's the wrong guy. guy first of all, right. the real guy got a whole swastika on his left. He chest. got the SS thing on. He his... got the Schutzstaffel uh, double bolt tattoo yeah. on his, and then you see his history of social media. Yeah, is anti-Jewish, anti. -Jewish, anti Minorities, yeah, you know, and what he saying? had the uh, the thing, the patch of uh, it's like the right wing executioner squad or something, yeah, the the right the, wing the, death squad, right wing death squad, right patch. wing death squad, yeah, you know, what I'm saying, I think that's important for I think for it's a few what he was saying, yeah, I think it's important because for one, if you notice at the end, he said they keep trying to attach us to this stuff, basically, that was his, his uh, his or his point. But how my question is, how is saying that he's a white supremacist attached to y'all? What? Say it one more time. How is me calling this man a white supremacist an attack on that side? Because if because if you're not about yeah. that, yeah. then you can just you can just put a disclaimer. I said that's not that's not right wing stuff. Yeah. That's not that is not what we represent. That is not what we go for. That is not right wing. It's an identity of what he think it is. Yeah. And that's not it. That is not us. He could have just said that and been cool. First of all, he's wrong on so many levels. Yeah. Not the right, I, that's not the right person, right? No. Not the right person. It is a person that is that do have uh uh if the reports are right, he is a person that is uh uh, uh a white supremacist. No, nah, well, he's he believes in white white supremacy. Yeah. Or whatever the case is. And then 
from what I keep hearing, it was like he's Hispanic, and they keep saying like, "How is he Hispanic and, and white supremacist?" But if we got people like Nick uh, Fuentes, yep. who clearly has said he don't like Jews and has said negative things about black people. Just just recently, he was on this thing called what Pearly Things. Yeah, just and Pearly Things. Just Pearly yeah. Things, and said something to the I think it was an Italian girl he was talking to, and said something about y'all saying you date black men, so your family gonna disown you. Something, something to that nature. Mm -hmm. Even though he walking with Kanye, he says things like that. And my bad. What what's the dude leader of the Proud Boys? Talk about the leader of the Proud Boys. Enrique Tarrio. Okay, then who who uh, domestic terrorist? If I'm not mistaken, he was one of the people that was with the Proud Boys who burned uh, Black Lives Matter on a church. Uh, 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 oh, okay. Mm -hmm. And then there's other stuff that we'll put in there yeah. where there's other Hispanic people who does things that are against uh, other races because it's because of their race. Other hate crimes. Yeah, I think for I, me, let me oh, say this done? last piece. Let me say okay, this last right. piece. White supremacy doesn't mean that a person is white right. and you think that he's superior. It's an it's an ideology. Yes. It yes. Is, it is not a... It is to, not. to be a white supremacist, the definition is a person who believes that white people are superior and should dominate society. And by extension, anyone who fights to maintain that idea. Let me ask you something. Anybody. Even myself. We all seen Django. Oh. You already know that's, where I'm going. I, I, boy, that's, a, that's a good We point. all seen Django. That's a good point. Calvin Candy, slave master. Loyal servant. Who was it? Stephen Warren. That's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a good point. Stephen Warren, the black slave who fought to protect his master that's a good point. and his standing Mr. Candy, no. in, in, that, in that whole system was a white supremacist. That's a good point. That's why. That's, that's, you know what I'm saying? beautiful. Come that's on, beautiful. son. beautiful. Anybody who, and, and like, and for me, for a person who doesn't understand how you can be a white supremacist and not be white, just shows the lack of knowledge you have and understanding and how European ideas have truly affected the rest of the, the rest of the world. Like, especially like when it comes to Hispanic in this, in this situation, when Spain came to uh, South America and the Caribbean, mm -hmm. they instilled this idea that the closest to the closer you are to white, the more, uh, the better you are, the better person you are. They have their own whole caste system Ooh, I didn't down think there. About you know I what I'm saying? That point. I'm mad. I'm mad you like, got to before I did. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm like, like, and that's and that's been all, all around, like where Europe has touched. Like, the closer you are to white, even in India, they got the untouchables. The darker skin you are, the mm -hmm. worse you are. They got words for the different stuff like that, bro. In every in, 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 in every in set, India, South you know America, what I'm saying? Uh, Australia, there's different words to, to show that if you're lighter, you're closer to this, and if right. you're darker, you're this. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Like, and for people who fight for the idea to keep that on top, you, you are white, white supremacists. supremacists. Like, look at white. Belgium and how they, they how they did Rwanda. You look at Belgium, how they came in, and they decided the Tutsi Ooh. was superior to the Hutu people. And people don't even know nothing about Come that. On, let, me have your right, let me have your right hand real quick. Let me go ahead and just cut, let me hold that real quick. Let me hold that. Bro, and I don't get the I don't understand the ideas that people have about it. well he's not white. Well, I'm not part of the uh, uh, LGBTQI community yeah. plus and all that other mm -hmm. all the letters. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I'm, I'm never getting them right. Yeah, I ain't part of that, but mm -hmm. I support them. Yeah, I support their their their, their place to be free. Right, just because they have people that are white and they support you know what I'm saying black causes, they don't have mm -hmm. they don't have to be black to support our causes. So they don't have to be white to support white supremacy. I don't understand the right. You, they don't, if you can understand yeah. that, and I don't understand how you don't understand yeah. this. That's why. That's why I be talking about like people like like some people don't get that though. People it, some like a lot of times if like if I or you or somebody like no, let me tell you about like like we was talking about the Dave Chappelle and how like we were speaking for. Like, hey, this is a different perspective. This is how they feel. This is a, mm -hmm. oh, yeah. you must like them. You must be in oh, that you, group. I told you, I told you, I hate people. Yeah, oh, you, I had a discussion. You my gotta wife about be that. that in order to defend it. Or no, we can be smart and we can see we other side of the discussion. position. You know what we what just saying? had that discussion you know a few saying? minutes ago. Yeah. Well, before we started about how people do that. Yeah. Just because I'm trying to figure something out, just because I'm asking questions about something, don't mean I support it. Yeah. Doesn't mean I'm trying to figure out why. Or do you I'm feel a part like of it. Or I'm a part of it. Because I might support it. And I just understand what they viewpoint, but you just don't want to. Oh, you must be gay. Yeah. You, you think they should be. That's it. No, or I, I think I, 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 I could just be. Yeah, I could just be intelligent. I could just be that able to be, see. I could be yeah. reasonable. Yeah, I could be, be reasonable. reasonable. Human I could be. Yeah, yeah. I could be human. Yeah. And I understand human experiences. That's what I. Because be. the worst thing, the worst thing people do is assume somebody else's position. 
like 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 when I was saying like in that uh Dave Chappelle, Dave Chappelle discussion, how people was like, oh, there's only uh two sexes, or there's two genders. Well, there's two different conversations you have right yeah. there. Some people are talking about sex, other people, people are talking about, about gender. gender. If you keep automatically assuming that these people, you people are coming at you because you're saying there's only two sexes, then you're gonna always have a conflict. But if you go into that large discussion of gender and gender expression, that's a whole different conversation. Let me do this. Let me curve back around. Okay. Right. Curve, let me, curve, let me, curve on, sir. Around, curve on, sir. How did this news network not realize they had the wrong person? Hey, first of all, <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I, I forgot. First like, we ain't got so good yeah. in the conversation. I yeah, forgot yeah, that yeah, we yeah. was like supposed to be talking about news, man. Yeah. And like, hold on, hold on. They got the wrong person. The wrong person, bro. And not only did they get the wrong person, they got the wrong, like, they talked about this man. As you, as a matter of fact, they right. The person they talk about, the person they have on the screen, <laughs> right. you, they you, absolutely right. You right. <laughs> you absolutely right. That man is. That, that, man, that is, man, as far as, as I know, know y'all saying he's friend. not a white supremacist at all. You right about that. You got me. You could be right. But you the person that did he, the shoot, he's he, he sound like you know he's. The, if he's not, he fits the description. He fits the description. He fits the description. He damn well fits that. So I don't know. Like this. That's what this. This is why I think Newsmax is foolish. Trash. Because th this is you report. Not saying that other news networks don't get it wrong, but for the amount of times that they get stuff wrong that I feel like I have seen mm -hmm. is ridiculous. Especially on this. My man is talking confidently about yeah. that. He's he's boldly speaking about how these... He's these smug. Love, these I don't smug. like the smugness. Oh, it's, it's you know, I don't thing. like smug, how you entitled that smug? people. You ain't got the right person. Yeah, he don't know. That's ignorance. You know what I'm saying? Ignorance. And if you can't even get something as, as basic as that correct, then how like how do you trust your organization? I really don't like, blame. I blame his. I blame him. Don't get me wrong, but I blame whoever put. He like, could have. He could have. Did he ask? Hey, is this right guy? <sighs> did y'all make sure this yeah, is right? Because he probably right, could have just yeah. assumed that they had the right guy. Go. Why would you get the wrong person? He could have looked on Twitter and looked. Hey, this ain't this ain't my man. Who is this? This is oh, this is different, Mauricio. Yeah, he, he's he's uh. All he needed was a man with the same name. And a Hispanic fellow. I'm not even sure. Because I think, because if I looked it up right when I seen this, the dude, this dude is like three years older than the other guy, like 36. Yeah. And the other, and the other dude, 33. That's a big. That's like. I, that's three years. Yeah, that's yeah. three years. Yeah. That's that's that's. That's a that's a freshman to a senior. That's yeah. that's what that is. I, basically, yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying like. So, but I get it. I get it, though. That's what they do. They, you know, you got to get this news out as fast as you can. Like, we make mistakes. Mm -hmm. I understand. But we ain't the news network. So, I will say that much. Yeah. We don't have a support team. It's me and him. That's it. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> so, that's why we tell y'all, like, if we mess up, y'all let us know. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Y'all are our production team. But ain't no excuse for this. No, ain't no excuse for that. Ain't no excuse for that. You got a whole department supposed to be doing yeah, that research yeah. for you. Somebody needs to be Five. It's a sad thing with an actual. Well, not five. These reprimand. It's a sad thing with an actual satirical news shows like the Daily Show is more reliable than Ooh, the actual. But that's news. that's that the. Whew, that's a that's a good point. It is a sad day, man. That's a good point. I remember when John Stewart. He was talking to uh Tucker Carlson. He was like, "Well, you do the news." He's like, "Look, my news network come on after." A prank Pu uh, uh, out the puppets uh, cut back and crank calls. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Show, I'm on a network of this, you know what I'm saying? On, of, of comedians. Like this is just supposed to be a joke. My yeah. whole situation is a joke. Y'all report the news. Y'all supposed to be factual. Y'all supposed to not divide. Y'all supposed to bring people together with the truth. Mm -hmm. Y'all supposed to expose. Y'all supposed to just put the light on things that we didn't know about. That yeah. is what y'all supposed to be doing. Newsmax. That is what you supposed to be doing. News to the max. News to the max. <laughs> and y'all are just giving me minimal effort, not only in your journalism, but in your approach to how to how you report things mm -hmm. and your, how biased I feel like y'all are. Yeah. Y'all continuously put stuff out there that is biased. Like when we watched the Marjorie Taylor Greens or uh, 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 Fox and went left, they done went woke fire and took Carson because of this, that, and the third. But I don't I don't hear you bring up the Dominion case and how he was lying and, yeah. the, and how the 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 text messages contradicted the way he, he spoke is out exactly loud. the problem tucker carlson was speaking against yeah that's a fact that's a fact check out the, uh, our last video about uh our reaction to uh, tucker carlson making his announcement and what he was saying about how news networks be lying doing tucker carlson the prophet the prophet that's a that's a fact <laughs> that is a fact out. calling out these ridiculous news yeah. networks for the, what they were doing come on AKA man the christ second coming I think I think that's just ridiculous, bro. I don't understand. I don't understand how you. you I mean, I do understand how you 
swing and miss on this, yeah. but it's just like it's about getting. The, he just care about the views. Care about he was clips. just too smug about this. Care, yeah, I care think about that's the problem. Appeasing his base. I'm more. I'll be more forgiving if he wasn't so smug. Yeah, because you can tell his smugness. He thought he had a hit. Like, oh, they thought they got us. Oh, yeah, because because they cause, thought they got cause us. Because to be honest, if if I thought that the left had did some stuff like that, and they had that like, this guy wasn't who they try to project he was, then yeah, I can understand. I understand the smugness. But that only makes sense if he identifies with white supremacy. Because it still goes back. It still to that. goes back to what it you said earlier. It still goes back to that. Because if you don't identify with white supremacy. It's not but, a hit. But, but I will say this. He did say, he said, they try to make anybody who's part of MAGA mm -hmm. uh, uh, a bad thing. So that's, that's what I'm saying. I, I will give him that. Okay. If he say that, you know what I'm saying, y'all always try to, when, every, when somebody does a shooting uh -huh. or something like this, and he has he support Trump or MAGA. Y'all try to say that we even we, though like we what, give y'all these ideologies. Ninety nine percent of mass shootings are like by right wing people. I didn't see that statistic, but a lot of them are. Because yeah. I think I think on one of the things they were saying like how I think they said that he was watching Tim Pool, not this guy, but the, Tim Pool. He was watching Nick Fuentes. He was yeah. He said, I, I forgot what it was that they they said they got on him, but it was some yeah. right wing yeah. uh, person that he quoted, and then the other guy who did a shooting at a church or a mosque or something. Mm -hmm. They said that he had was listening to uh, Ben Shapiro mm -hmm. or something. Uh, so it was like I get it. Like I don't never, I don't never see, and I could just be not. I could just be missing. Yeah. I could be in the echo chamber, which I doubt because I mm -hmm. watch all type of stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, but I never really see any shootings where you hear somebody quoting AOC. No, <laughs> that'd be some, that'd be crazy. Bernie Sanders got me out here yeah. like this. Right. You know what I'm saying? Of, like I don't never see I, that. Oh, you don't really see that. And I think I think. All jokes aside, people really need to step back and ask themselves, why do people like Mar Marcio Garcia and people who are in the neo-Nazism, why do they gravitate so heavily to the right? Yes, yeah, I mean that is good. That's, and that's MAGA a ideology. That's so a you can question. you can say all you want about we separate ourselves. Why is it that that's these people question. always identify with that side of the aisle? That's an honest That's a question, question you need to ask yourself. What, however you feel about being a conservative or a Democrat or something, yeah. why do these people... I'm okay with you being on that side, yeah. but you should add, really ask your question right. these people that you're looking at. If, you, if we got to take responsibility for people like Antifa, take responsibility for these people. Yeah. That's the only way we're going to do better. Ask yourself honestly, why do these people constantly identify with that side of the aisle? That's real. People in the comments says, do me a favor. If there's any mass shooter who has a meta, uh, meta, what's some things called they be writing? Manifesto. Manifesto. You have a manifesto of any kind that says that Bernie Sanders told them to do that or AOC or any other left. Yeah, let liberal, us know, man. Let us know. Let us know. And then they did a mass shooting or anything. Yeah. Not anything because, you know, you can't just like, well, he painted the wall and he said Bernie Sanders. No, you can't be doing that. Either if it's graffiti or something like that, I'm talking about violent crime. Yeah, yeah and we'll go from there. We'll go from there. You know what I mean? That's what I would like Cause to even, see. Because even then, like, yeah, let's just say if Martin Luther King went on the shooting spree, could you blame him? <laughs> I would have been like, hey. Could you blame him? You know what I'm hey, saying? Like, make it make it. Anyway, I digress, You're tired man. of getting hit in the head and not doing yeah. that. Bitten by dogs, water hoses. Or somebody yeah, got to get somebody, shot at this point. Somebody get it. But anyway, I, that's all I got. Man, you know what I got nothing, though. Be careful what you watch. Me. Research what you watch. Make sure you get the right information in the right places. Cross-reference your information. Yep. What he said. I'm TK AKA. To the max. To the max. I'm TK <laughs> AKA the Destroyer Conviction. I'm Darius AKA the Mirror of Truth. And this is mine again. Yeah.